Since the beginning of the 2014 campaign, she talked about ending her season right here in our home state of Oklahoma. Ladies and gentlemen, your ABCA Division One Player of the Year is Penn State's Micah Hancock. Hi everyone, we're in Oklahoma City, side of the 2014 Division I NCAA Women's Volleyball Championships. I'm Jack Hammond with Volleyball Magazine, and with us is... Micah Hancock. And Micah, you play for... Penn State yeah. University. All right, we like to have people introduce themselves, but first of all, congratulations. You were just honored by the American Volleyball Coaches Association as the Player of the Year. Did you expect it? No, I did not. Um, you know, I'm sitting alongside uh, Van Sant and Lowe, and I'm like, what? You know, like, these are great players. So, you know, it kind of hit me by surprise, and a couple of tears came out, and I kind of wiped my face to talk, but it's, it's a great honor. You know, a lot of young players coming up have to deal with their parents in one way or another. Parents either get too involved or parents not involved enough. Your parents get some amount of media attention and all. How, how were your parents when you were first learning the game and how have they evolved while you were in college in terms of how they deal with you? When I first started playing, you know, my mom coached me, so she was always at me to be competitive and, you know, try my best, play hard, and then, you know, as I as I evolved to the Penn State way, you know, she still tries to coach me, but um, um, I've told her, you know, there's a boundary. I have my own coaches, and I love that she wants to help as much as she can, but I also tell her, you know, take a step back, Mom. We've got it under control, and I, I know she's doing it to support me, so. Something that people don't really, if you don't play the game, see all that much is the relationship between passers and their setter. People see the setter and their hitters. Right. Tell me about what you need, what you do at Penn State with you and your passers. Well, my passers are very talented people, and I am very grateful for that. Um, but uh, you know, I have confidence. I have full confidence in my passers. Uh, you know, Megan and Dom are basically our primary passers, and they do a great job of getting me the ball and you know making my job easier. And um, you know, I look at them and I know they're struggling, and say, hey, you know, one breath at a time, you know, one ball at a time. So. I try to calm them down when they get a little antsy, but I, I have full confidence in them. Okay, finally, um, you know that this phase is ending and that you're gonna have other phases in your volleyball life, but um, for kids who are just coming up, who are hoping and interested in going to college, what do you wish you knew when you were first entering college that you know, that you know now? What did you wish you knew that back then when you were first starting? You know, I wish I knew how challenging it would be and just um, the first run of it. You know, you don't really know what's going on and I think one thing to embrace is the freshman year of you know trying to understand everything and as fast as you can you know as once once you get in your sophomore year, you're like oh I've done this before I've been here before and you can have a little poise about yourself but you know it's it's just really focusing in on one game at a time and not getting involved in all the hype around games thank you and again congratulations Micah Hancock the Penn State setter and the AVCA 2014 national player of the year thank you. I'm Jack Hammond thanks